Many Chinese universities, also including the open source course on the university, they make school and they make community, they make uh, code of conduct. That's a totally open source ecosystem study on the university. And full time engineers also join the job. How you are managing for open source development, uh, they support for the open source community and culture. Chinese big company kind of big donation for the Linux Foundation and Apache Foundation. It's the engineer contribute a lot for the open source. Many companies oppose, oppose them. I think they are very good running from the Cargo and Microsoft and Western huge companies or real open source. Kind of Chinese huge company also support us. Culture also includes it. This is an uncle for the Chinese uh, open source users. Why do you use open source software? Previously, just free, no need to pay, is the most important. But now, transparency is most important. Second one is a philosophy. Third one is a save the time, better way to develop. People understanding what is open source, what is the merit of the open source, what open source could change the technology. And also summarize the uh, company from company side to uh, open source. Big tech company is the open source division and hire the professional open source committer. This is our client in charge, John Bob, hired open source enthusiast by Alibaba, Oppo, Huawei, JD.com, and uh, uh, Hype Vision, make hardware company, software company, hire the professional open source committer. This is about the example. Alibaba Cloud Open Source Headquarters. They have a huge open source programming office, OSPO. And they need more higher engineer and open source advocate. Make good code and how to make good code by the community is most important for the Chinese companies. But this is, a, you know, already some example of open source software by Chinese. It is a, BuildGS is the most famous open software from China in Japan. I saw 40 books about BuildGS in Amazon Japan. And after design, this is a React based UI toolkit. 4400 uh, stars gathered on GitHub. And uh, open source based startup company also very famous in China. This company uh, called PinkCap, software called TidyB. They raised the 2020 hundred million dollars in CSD uh, on funding. They are both from China, but their branch in Singapore already, New York already, Japan already. And I have the CTO's presentation at the China Open Source Conference. He said, beginning of the era of Thai DB, the type on GitHub is only Chinese data. But now, almost 20 hours, uh, 365 days, continuous commitment from all over the world. That's the reason why Thai DB is global software, and Thai DB is the more uh, monthly software for the society. That's the reason why they did the funding. PinkCap company is providing uh, software as a service platform for the users, and still uh, supporting the community. Same business model as Heroku, Docker, and Replic Search is China uh, completely copied that business model in there. And uh, this is a uh, uh, chart from the Chinese uh, venture capital. Fundraising OSS company, ThinkUp, and some companies called Unicode already. And Chinese uh, fund focused open source. Because uh, uh, we, uh, Kai Wen Sha and Rose Kai Wen members, sense for the business. If the proprietary software from China, how to make the market to work? Very, very, very hard. Uh, extremely uh, hard. But the uh, open source, open standard from China, more easy to grow in the growth. And uh, many Chinese companies not need the fee from IT, we need the more developed standard, we need the more developed building together. That's the reason why the China government and the Chinese uh, company focus on more and more open source. This is most of the important slide in my share uh, from uh, Yunqi Capital Chinese VC. They told uh, 
current of open source 3.0 era for the business. The beginning of open source, open source 0.0, is very really typical software guys like are GNU and Linux. Almost no biggest model, but just to work hard. I really like to just work hard. And also just to change the society. This is the most primary important on the purpose. And second one, RAM, Linux, Apache, MySQL, PHP era. Building the software, uh, building the solution, building the service by only open source software and uh, doing the same thing as the software development. This era is uh, almost the same as the normal company. Use for free, support for the pay is a version 1.0. And version 2.0, the software as a service era, Cloudera, Confluent, Kafka, these are makes community a better, makes software as a service better, and makes for good service by the community. This is a very uh, good way for the Apache Software Foundation, they saw the community over code. Makes good community, they contribute and renew the software a lot, that's the reason why we pay the fee for the software as a service. Then now, newest one, open source software 3.0, uh, like uh, MongoDB, Databricks, also GitHub and TiDB. This is uh, not just a cloud native, always uh, open source software, uh, just a platform as a service model. Scalable, distributed, cloud service business model, uh, almost all solution is open source. Very hard to find a problem. But we still pay for the software. Currently, community is most important. How developing the software is most important. Proprietary or uh, open source is not so important. If you make a global community, if you make a big developing power, if you can hire a million engineer, you can do the proprietary. But very hard. Google also uh, sometimes doing the open source because Google people are also very clever. Google is brilliant engineers there, but they know although Google is much, much better. <laughs> That's the reason why they are choosing the open source. And also the community side, we, uh, our community is still growing. Uh, open Infra Foundation uh, is a global community. Platinum member is far away, Tencent Cloud, and the group Alibaba. We are working together with Sony, Ericsson, Facebook, Windows, Red Hat, Microsoft, in the open source side, Western people and the Eastern people working together to make a platform. Probably, Open Infra Foundation's real purpose is making very good cloud software expect us. And many projects from China, incubation by Linux Foundation, Apache Software Foundation, Cloud Native Foundation, last year, Linux Linux Foundation makes 50 projects incubate already. That 15 project is all coming from China. And also, Open Atom Foundation was there. This is a power by Tongo Dongfu from Shinbu. The China government supported the Open Source Foundation. They are official foundation. They can make the regulation. They can make the law for the open source in China. And uh, they build the license, integrate open source software from China, and push open source culture from the government and for the university and the company and makes low support in open source. This is one of the examples from the Open uh, Atom Foundation. They make the new license, Mulan uh, Software, Permission Software License version 2, Mulan PSL. This is almost similar to Apache license, but more uh, China friendly. Uh, because of, in China, uh, some system is a different from the United States. This is software, uh, this license is a good for the Chinese society. And uh, also, dual language, both English and Chinese, compatible. This license purpose means makes contract from Chinese company to overseas company using the same, same license for the open source. This license is a uh, initiative or uh, authorized already to open source initiative approved. And uh, we Chinese making a new one for the GTL style uh, license for China. <laughs> and also open source hardware style. I would like to well known Chinese uh, style copy card called the Shanzai. When a China company makes a lot of copy. But uh, this Shanzai style is transforming now to the Gonka. 
uh, later, Baliba uh, will come into each other this way. Uh, these two words is an uh, idea from Baliba. New software engineers and entrepreneurs are helping the climate tech clients, such as Xiaomi, Oppo, uh, and Happy Air Robot. I try to explain about that where the Shanzai comes from and where the Shanzai happened what. Shanzai means Chinese style open source hardware, but design shape, not being based on license. That's the reason why open source. Open source. Um, we share the design, we share the, the sometimes we share the hardware and we share the IP. This is a function is similar as open source, but not based on license. Current Chinese company is uh, focused for transforming share IP, share product, share knowledge, but based on open source license. Currently, more than 50% of risk five premium members are from China. Current China is the most popular risk five country in the world. Uh, you can see some Chinese company was there. The biggest one is the key head of, uh, is the best of Alibaba. They sold more 2.5 billion of chips by this to my best. And if you have the true wireless earphones there, in that earphone the price under $10, keep from China, Shenzhen, Jerry or Brutalance. These two companies are very uh, huge advocate for the risk part. Currently, this file is a common already. If you bought the Bluetooth chips under ten Singapore dollars, probably this file is cheap from China. Another best chip design company he has shipped out of two point five billion of this file chips. They are more open source, no any Shanghai was there. And uh, less than ten dollars Bluetooth chips and Bluetooth earphone and Bluetooth speaker. Uh, some kind of pie up about uh, Bluetooth IP, but uh, chipset IP is a purely uh, risk file. Our company, Sweet Science, uh, is an uh, uh, open source hardware market. We, our, uh, we sold a lot of Raspberry Pi, Arduino, and uh, M5 stack, ESP32, also PSLAB. Many open source hardware, risk file chips, servers, and sensors from China, day by day. I started the business from China from 2014. 2014's high-end hardware is okay, compatible, even cheaper than other. But uh, now the Chinese ha hardware from start from China, I never know yet. I never saw yet new style of technology from China, like uh, AI ASIC model and also uh, one chip SOC inside a lot of functions. Shanghai transforming to the public now, day by day. In this uh, this uh, system, uh, this uh, IoT development of uh, hardware is uh, called the M5 stack. ESP32 based uh, in screen and battery. There is a market is uh, currently bigger than Arduino in Japan. Thanks for the attention. Uh, we uh, currently uh, this uh, activity in post Asia is uh, very good for the uh, and memorial for the Kaiwen chart. Three Chinese open source committee want to more and more contribute to the world of uh, open source community. We start from running, we use it a lot of open source, and currently we want to commitment and contribute to the world of open source society. We think uh, more and more commitment to the next year, and also not only in Singapore, but other society. Marjara Singapore, Marjara Open Source Society. Thank you for coming. Thank you for coming. Thank you very much for your talk. Um, does any of the audience like to ask um, some questions? Chairman, no man, yeah. You know, I don't You know, I'm a best on Japanese. My mother is Japanese. <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. Can you hear me? Yeah, you talked about something uh, in Chinese, which is an alternative. Apache 2.0, right? So, what is the difference between Apache 2.0 in which you talked about? The difference between the, uh, the Chinese version of Apache 2.0 and Apache 2.0? 